Good morning. This is Paul, and today we're going to talk about this little aloe here called the red aloe or aloe cameroni. It's native to Malawi and Zimbabwe, if I remember correctly. It's hardy to 25 degrees, and it does really well in Southern California. I'm starting to see a lot more of them pop up, mainly probably because they're not that expensive and they do pup really quickly so I've not had this thing very long at all it was solid green until about a week ago or when it started getting colder a little bit of a cold snap so now this maybe was growing in a greenhouse but either way it has tons of pups already and once it was dealt with our climate here it's starting to turn red so the colder weather is what did that so it was like a solid green almost when you got it and that's kind of what I like about it, is it just has so much variety and color. So part of the year will be green in your yard, and with colder weather or drought tolerant, or really hot weather too, will turn red, from what I heard. So I have not had this long. I've been looking for it for a while. I have some family members that have had one for about two years, and it is definitely kind of like a two-colored little aloe, so if you keep it outdoors like I am. So this is next to our house. It gets most of the day, uh, three quarters of the day sun, I'd say. And we'll get a lot more sunlight in the summer. So it should be really, really happy. It's hardy to 25 degrees. The flowers will be orange to red as well. More on the redder side. And they're really beautiful. And it will bloom kind of quite profusely as it grows and multiplies out. I really like this aloe, aloe cameroni. The spines are not obtrusive or sp too painful or spiny. They're not bad. And it's just a really beautiful little aloe with kind of a waxy appearance. So uh, in terms of soil, I amended a bit of pumice, but it does these do fine in our native soil. They're not too picky as long as they have good drainage. They do not want to be sitting in water. You can also grow them in a pot, and I, I'm pretty sure you could grow them indoor, indoors if they get plenty of sunlight. So super cool plant, again, aloe cameroni. You'll see more of the, this plant in the future when it gets bigger and blooms. All right, give us a like and a subscribe. You have yourself a wonderful day. Take care. Bam.